Okay, hi viewers, we are back once again to give you some exciting actions. Please today, okay, before we go straight to today's action, I want to say thank you to our esteemed subscribers and want to remind our first timers to also do same, do subscribe, hit the bell and then leave your comments as we'll be working on them step by step. Okay, for today's action, we want to see how is possible for you to be lifted from the ground from the behind now two things first in by no means should you allow somebody to lift you from the back and up because once you are up sorry you are in danger but that's not the end of it there's also a way if perhaps you could not sustain yourself from not being lifted then you should resort to this other action okay now we how to lift is what we're talking about now sustain yourself do not even allow yourself to be lifted at first if you if you could not uh, do that if there's no way or maybe you you you've just been taken on our west and you're lifted now that should not be the end of it so now let's see let's just see example now pick me up can you see this now with this there's no way he can lift you from here now, if he tries too much, all you do is palm and it's off. Okay? So, that is how to sustain yourself from not being lifted. Okay, now let's assume he, he, you were not fast enough or you don't have the technical know how to be able to do that. Because once you do that, you stuck down, you cannot be lifted anymore. And if you try to persist, you saw what I did and it goes. Now, let's see, let's assume. You, there was no way you could stop him and he lifted you already. Now lift, pop. Okay, this should not be the end of it. Now once he lifts, he's not only lifting to hang you, he's looking for a way to throw you down. Now throw. Can you see that? Ay! You see this? Ah! Okay, now let's explain clearly. He lifts, right, and he tries to throw. I lock here and lock here. Mm. Huh? The leg is hooked. Now, if he dares to throw me down, he will definitely be caught. Can you see that? Then, ah. So, all hope is not lost if you are lifted. But however, you should try as much as possible not to be, not to allow the lifting in the first place. But like I said, if he succeeds to lift, that's what he should do. Because it's not lifting you to just keep you up there, it's lifting you to swing you down. So the moment you are up, lock the hand and lock the leg. If he dares to throw you down, he will definitely go down. Like I said, I always tell us, now whatever we are doing, you cannot just wake up one day and think you can do it. You have to be trained. Some people will see it as if, ah, it's not possible. But I tell you, 100% is possible. All is about training. Once you are trained and you have the knowledge, you will definitely know how to do it and how to take yourself out of different kinds of situations. Okay, now, that was from the back. Now let's try the front. Of course, you know the back lifting is much more dangerous because you can be taken on unawares. But the front, you are there. Now it tries to come in. Palm, all you do is step back. And once you step back, you see this. Palm, you can sink him down with that. Now this strike, you will decide where you are taking it. If you just want to sink him down, you take it. But if you want to dislocate the spinal cord, palm, that's where the elbow strike goes to. Now. With that, you, you, the fight is over. There's no more lifting and there's no more fight. Okay, now let's assume he succeed to lift. Now lift, he succeed to lift, bam. What you do is bam, clamp the ear. You see that? Okay, lift again. Immediately lift, clamp the ear. Don't want to go out to struggle and think oh, you are up the, you are off ground and you because if you waste any second he wants to swing you. Now once you climb the ear, 
He will lift you. He will just relieve you. All right? So you climb in here and strike here. All in one second. Now lift. Bam, boom! See that? The moment you are up there, before he swings you, bam, bam! That's it. Okay? So just learn it. It's, it's easy when you learn it, but it's difficult when you don't. Okay? Now, let's assume you throw a kick. Like some, some people would think that you, you throw a kick, grab the leg. That with the moment your leg is grabbed, that you are useless. But I want to tell you again that that leg you've grabbed, you are endangering yourself. Except you are grabbing who is not a professional. Because from here, the next thing I do is I pull and strike. Can you see that? And that strike goes with the hand. I pull one in. See that? When I strike that, I'm striking. Boom! I said we have to be very careful in all the techniques we do. They are raw and devastating. Now watch the slow move of it so that you understand. Okay, okay, I throw a kick, pop, he grabs it. Now I pull. The moment I pull, he will step in and I sink the leg back with a strength. Boom! So there's no way. Even if I want to use another form, Grab the leg again. Now I want to use another form. I turn. Let's see that. By the time I turn, boom. Watch again. Grab. I turn. See, the moment you turn the hand, you freeze the hand or the leg. I can decide to come back this way. I can decide to turn this way with the strike. Okay? Kick. Now I, let's assume I turn. And my turning was not swift enough for him to release the leg. Now I turn, he's still holding the leg. No, I'll... Thrust! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, you can see what happened. Slow motion. Okay, now watch. You see, it's when I said we should be very careful, it's devastating. So let me take it very slow. Now I take the kick. Now. I turn, my turn wasn't swift enough to let him free the leg, pop, and he's still holding it. Remember, notice that I have bent the leg now. The next thing is thrust back with force. And that will happen, that will happen. what happened, you see it happen. Okay? So we'll leave you with this today. Next time we'll come your way, as you leave your comments and subscribe, we'll still be giving you some good actions. Stay tuned. Um, as we leave you today, just stay tuned to our next uh, video that's coming. We'll be giving, showing you how to deal with two men or multiple attackers. And according to your comments about rushing and non-rushing, you're going to understand through the explanation and actions on that video. So stay tuned for that until we come your way next time.